Hi guys, it's Doris from Look Amazing, and today I'm going to do a video for our Fashion Closet Essential series. And since the weather is warming up, I thought it'd be a perfect time to show you guys our picks for pieces that would be perfect for warmer weather. So I'm just going to get started. So the first piece I've chosen is this white linen sweater. Um, I really love this one because it has kind of holes throughout, so it gives it a very airy feel, and I feel the fabric linen is also perfect for the summer because it's very light, um, so it's a perfect layering piece. This is something I can see myself wearing um, actually over a bathing suit as well, so it could be a cover-up. So I'm going to feature the next two items together. Um, these are pretty much just cotton tees, but one is gray and one is striped. Um, I featured the plain white tee in a previous video, but for the summer, I recommend having more because these are very, very comfortable and you can always layer things over it. So I chose these two particular colors slash um, prints because I feel like they're both kind of on the neutral side um, and I think stripes are really easy to pair with um, a lot of different bottoms. So next I have also another top and here is another simple plain tank top. Um, I chose this one in particular because I love this blue color, um, but it's of a linen material so once again very lightweight and also perfect for the summer. So next I'm going to move on to an outerwear piece and this one here is an army green um, safari vest. So I would recommend either a vest or um, the full long sleeve jacket but I chose the vest um, because I thought it would be great to wear um, button down tops underneath and so you can kind of still see the sleeves coming out of it and if you had a pattern top it would look really good. So yeah, but I love this color because it's really nice when it's paired with denim or white pants. So now I'm going to move on to bottom and I have here with me two pairs of light wash denim um, of different styles. So the first one um, it's a skinny pair of jeans and pretty simple, um, so I think this is great for pairing with um, pattern tops. And then the next pair, which is a very comfortable pair, are my boyfriend jeans. And these, I love kind of the ripped detail in the front and also it's a very, kind of more on the looser side in terms of fit, so it's um, comfortable and perfect for kind of if you're going on a picnic and you need to sit on the ground. I think this pair of denim is perfect for that. So, And next up I have shorts. So I have two pairs of shorts here. Um, the first one is a denim short. And I really like kind of the distressed look so it has holes here but it's perfect for a casual look. And next I have a khaki kind of neutral color short and this is Great for if you want to dress up just a little tad, um, and it pairs well with a lot of floral tops. So, yeah, so these are my kind of go-to pairs of shorts. So next I'm going to feature two pairs of shoes, and the first one are these pair of slip-ons, and they are really, really comfortable and a really versatile shoe. You know, I think I'm crazy because they're also linen material and the neutral color makes it really easy to pair with different things, especially they look good with shorts and skirts and also denim. So yeah, so these are my pretty much go-to ones, especially if I'm going on vacation. So my second pair of shoes is this pair of gladiator sandals. Um, we featured this in our How to Style the Gladiator Sandal Trend video, so if you want more details on how to style these, you can definitely check that out. But I think sandals are definitely an essentials for summer, and the Gladiator one I think adds a little bit more detail if you're going for something more of a statement level, but I chose a neutral color so it pairs with a lot of the essential pieces as well. And last but not least is a fedora hat. So um, for those of you guys who are going to be out in the sun a lot, a hat is very essential to protect your face from the sun. So I hope you guys liked my picks for the essentials for warmer months. And if you think I'm missing anything, definitely comment down below and let me know. And until next time.